Welcome back to another vlog. If you're new, my name's Lauren. It's Christmas Eve and I'm still trying to wrap my head around the fact that the holidays are literally here. I can't believe it's Christmas Eve and tomorrow is Christmas Day. So I really hope you guys had an incredible holiday. If you celebrate, I hope you spent it with family, friends, or loved ones. I feel really lucky and fortunate that I get to go spend it with my immediate family tonight on Christmas Eve. So I'm really excited to have everyone together and celebrate the holidays. So I wanted to start off the vlog in front of the Christmas tree and open up the last advent calendar. I think I'm just gonna open up today and tomorrow right now, to be honest, because I don't wanna bring this big box with me for just a day. I have three, it's three different days basically because I have a huge bonus day, which it keeps like slipping through. So I kind of like know what it is. <laughs> like the whole entire time I've known what it is because it's kept like slipping through the little compartment. I mean, when it moves, it just like slips. So I kind of know what it is, but um, I'm just gonna go ahead and open up the 24th, 25th, and then the bonus day. And then we'll head to my dad's. Okay, what's this? Okay, Tarte Double Take. Ooh, an eyeliner, which I use the Kat Von D liquid eyeliner whenever I decide to do eyeliner, which is not very often. It's only when I kind of maybe go out or date night, dinners. Um, I'm wearing some tonight because we're going out to dinner for Christmas Eve, but I'm excited to try this because once I find something I like, I hardly ever try something new. So I'm gonna try this out. Ooh, the Laura Mercier Pure Canvas Primer. It's a hydrating primer. Looks like this. Excited to try that. Um, okay, let's open the bonus day now. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen this the whole time. It's the Sephora Lychee Face Mask. It helps you moisturize and glow. And that's the completed advent calendar. Truly such a fun experience. And I looked forward to it every single day, it was so fun. So I highly recommend doing this next year if you guys are interested, plan ahead, pick it out. Um, I picked this out in October, but I'm so glad that I did it, it truly was worth the money. But anyways, I'm gonna throw on a jacket and pack up a bag since I'm staying the night there and head to my dad's house. We're going to Brio for dinner, which we used to go to Brio every single Christmas Eve Growing up, we've spent a lot of Christmas Eves at Brio. I know it's just like a chain restaurant, but we're going there tonight. And it's gonna feel just so nostalgic, like my childhood, because we haven't been in a few years and just as nice. It's like familiar and yeah, I'm excited. So yeah, that's what's going on. This is absolutely insane for Florida weather. And I can't believe we're actually getting a really cold Christmas. This is really cold like tonight and tomorrow morning it's supposed to be in the 30s we are truly getting a really cold christmas which is nice for florida because sometimes it's in the 70s and 80s and then it really doesn't feel like christmas but this is nice so i'm really bundled up for christmas because it's obviously really cold wearing like a 
fuzzy white turtleneck sweater, big coat. And then it's pretty casual with the jeans. I'm also not wearing Uggs to dinner, but I'm wearing them over to my dad's. But this is the fit, not really that dressy, but it's totally fine. I packed a bag for my dad's house, packed my Christmas PJs, just some things that I need for tonight. And obviously I always pack a Christmas mug and I'm bringing this one over to have my morning coffee at my dad's house. So I'm about to head out the door. It's four o'clock and we have dinner at six and yeah. From now on our troubles will be mine. I'm staying in the guest room at my dad's house. This actually was my brother's old room. My room doesn't even <laughs> have anything in it. So this is now the guest room because me and my sister shared a bathroom. So it made more sense to make this the guest room because it has a separate bathroom. But I'm gonna stay in here. I brought my Christmas PJs, of course, and some Ugg slippers. <laughs> got home a little bit ago made an iced latte I'm doing some laundry today I'm gonna head back over to my dad's house later to eat dinner with everyone but I just wanted to come home for a little bit and get some laundry done and bring back my stuff that I took over when I stayed the night at my dad's house last night and unpack that bag and things like that and he lives like 20 minutes away from me so it's really not a big deal to drive back and forth Wanted to get a little bit of a head start on my laundry because I'm gonna be editing all day tomorrow. If you guys have been watching me for a little bit every single year, except for the first year I think that I did YouTube, but every single year that I've done YouTube, I always do a year end review video, kind of like an end of the year recap of clips from the year. So it takes me basically a full day to pick out clips, go through every single clip file because I keep it all on an external hard drive and go through it all, combine them. The editing takes a little bit too and then finding music, things like that. So I'm dedicating all day tomorrow to do that since I do have it off of work. So 
I'm gonna be locked into my computer all day tomorrow <laughs> to do that. So I think I'm gonna watch another Christmas movie and just chill on the couch, do my laundry, try and finish my laundry, and then head back over to my dad's for dinner. Just wanted to update you guys. I hope you guys had an incredible Christmas if you celebrate, but I'm gonna head to the couch, drink this, watch a Christmas movie, switch the laundry, and I'll pick up the camera later. gone it is now 2 22 and I've just been sitting right here at my computer pulling all of the footage for my year-end review video and kind of just going through every single video clip basically from the whole entire year so that took a really long time and now I'm slowly but surely like putting it together so it's just gonna take a little bit for me to do that but I need to go to the grocery store and just get ready for the work week. I'm actually going to be house sitting slash dog sitting for my boss while him and his family are out of town. So I'm gonna be doing it just for a few days and then my coworker is gonna finish out the week because I have people coming into town for New Year's. So I just need to like pack a bag because I'm gonna be staying the night there and um, just put together all of my breakfast, lunches, and dinners for the two days that I will be there just so I don't have to spend money on food, eat out. So I need to prep my lunches and dinners for those days and breakfast and everything. And then I'm gonna be working from his house so I don't really need to bring like my work clothes. So I'm just gonna be dressing pretty casual for that. But anyways, that's the update I wanted to share. This came in the mail from Adina Eden and it used to be called Adina's Jewels, but she rebranded this year. So now it's called Adina Eden and I got a necklace from them. Very simple necklace. It's like a paper clip chain. So it looks like this it's on the longer side which i wanted specifically for layering i love jewelry accessories i think it can just elevate any outfit and make it unique to you so i got this to layer with other necklaces i wear a lot of basics on the weekends i wear a lot of basics to work and i wear a lot of like black on black and I feel like necklaces really do separate and elevate the outfit and it could just be a little basic pair of slack pants and a basic top and with jewelry it just elevates it so i'll link it down below i wanted to just quickly share that with you guys before i left and went to the grocery store christian is I think on his way home from being in South Florida, he went home for the holidays. So since he's on his way home, I want to get like, the grocery store done, my meals and things figured out. I want to get my backpack so that way we can spend time together tonight because we obviously didn't spend Christmas together or anything like that. And then I'm going to be gone for a few days house sitting for my boss. So I want to get everything that I need to get done done now before he gets back in town so yeah that's what's going on right now i'm also really sad because i lit up my christmas tree and i'm sad because i know we're going to be taking it down this weekend so i'm trying to soak up every minute with my christmas tree before we take it down but anyways yeah i'm gonna head to the grocery store get my stuff done and then come back and start packing and then prepping my food Just got home from the grocery store. I'm gonna share a quick haul. So I'm gonna start over here. I'm gonna do a salad for lunch. It's kind of easy to bring with me since I'm staying at my boss's house to house sit and dog sit. So I got this, their little easy like pre-packaged chicken from Costco in a big pack. So I just wanted to pop it out of the fridge to share an example of what I'm gonna be doing, but I got some red onion to go on the salad, tomatoes to go on the salad, some peppers to go on the salad, cucumber for the salad, 
and then romaine. And this is gonna be the topping. Got some regular yellow onion for tacos this week. Christian has been loving these cottage cheeses with pineapple in them, so I got him some more of those. Got some guacamole. This one looked pretty good and it was on sale. Clementines, I've been really loving these lately and so is Christian, so I got a big bag of them. <laughs> Pineapple, two Doc Pop poppies, some bananas. I got some of these pita thins. We have some hummus in the fridge, so I wanted to grab these to eat with it. I got one of these. <laughs> Taco seasoning packets. This is gonna be my dressing for my salads for lunch, yogurt. They were out of the cashew milk that I love, so I got the milked walnuts one. Fresh Parmesan for the salad. This is what we're doing for dinner. It's just a really easy dinner, and it was on sale, so I got two of them, and then popcorn, and that's the haul. I also went to Target and picked up a few things as well, like a few beauty things, beauty blender, hairspray, mascara, things like that. So. That's the haul, I'm gonna put it all away and then I'm gonna start prepping my lunches and dinners and then I'll share what I'm gonna bring for dinner for the next few days. I just finished prepping breakfast lunch dinner snacks I'm gonna go through it just in case you guys are interested in what I'm bringing for breakfast I have the coconut yogurt and pineapple and then I put some granola aside for each day here is the salad it is just lettuce tomato cucumber peppers red onion and then fresh grated parmesan on top and then here's the dressing and then I'm gonna put these little chicken bites on top of that so I have two of those and then for dinner I did the bonza chickpea pasta with some spinach and vodka sauce and I'm gonna utilize the chicken bites to mix on top of that for dinner so I have two of those and then for snacks <laughs> I have four hard-boiled eggs and I just put it in a big container and then I have two clementines in here and another set in there and then of course some popcorn and then i'm also gonna bring some poppies as well ginger lime and then the dock pop so this is what i am bringing with me i might bring some mixed nuts as well just to have as like an extra snack i think i'll be fine but i can always order food if i'm hungry but this is what i'm bringing with me <laughs> Okay, Christian just got home and we're gonna make some hot cocoa ornaments. Got this last weekend. I've never done one of these hot cocoa bombs before, so I don't know what to expect. I don't even know what's inside of them. Honey. <laughs> what it? 
<laughs> Are you sure you're supposed to drop the whole thing in there? Yes. Oh, there we go. <laughs> there we go. Now it's going. Look. Oh, that's cool. Oh.